Dr. Swarchala, Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. When is the right time to get pregnant after periods? This is a question most patients, especially newly married couples ask us. So I'll try to explain this in detail today. So the most important thing to do before planning a pregnancy or when you're failing to get pregnant is to track your menstrual cycle. By that I mean the duration of your cycle. So what is the first day of this menstrual cycle? It is the day you start bleeding and by bleeding I mean a free flow. Sometimes in some women you may have a little bit of spotting, you may have a little bit of smearing that is not considered as day one. The day you have a proper flow of blood is the first day of your period so consider that as day one now from that day you have to track the entire cycle and then see when you have the next period which is your next period the day you have a good proper bleeding that is your next period day so what is the duration between this period day and the next period day that is your menstrual cycle length now ovulation which is the release of egg from the ovaries usually occurs 14 days before periods. So how do you calculate now which day you're ovulating? It's very simple. You first have to calculate your menstrual cycle. Now I'm going to give you some examples. Suppose you have a 28 day period cycle. So it means that the day one of your period to the next day one of your period is 28 day cycle. Suppose then on the 14th day of this duration, you ovulate. Let me give you another example. Suppose you have a 30 day period cycle, then you ovulate on the 16th day of your entire duration. Another example, suppose you have a 32 day period cycle, then you ovulate on 18th day of your cycle. So it's very simple. If you have irregular periods, then track about three months of your period, make an average and then see which is minus 14 days from your next period. That way, because we can't go back in time and plan, that way you can plan ahead and for the next menstrual cycle, you can have intercourse and increase your chance of getting pregnant. So this is how you track your ovulation duration. And remember, the best time to get pregnant is when the egg ovulates. Without the egg ovulating, it's very difficult. But you have to remember, sperm survive inside the uterus for about three days. So there is no harm in having intercourse three days before your egg ovulates and alternate day after that, for some time so that there is a constant supply of sperms inside the uterus in case the egg ovulates a few hours here and there sperms will always be present to fertilize it so have you understood how to calculate when you are ovulating and when is the best time to get pregnant if you wish to understand more about this please feel free to contact us thank you a lot of effort has gone into making this video please like and subscribe us thank you